So I'm married and I have two kids, a son and a daughter, and Wellstar covers all of our family needs. I have been working in the construction industry for about 20 years. I think it's very important specifically as you get um, a, a little older is making sure that all men have some kind of health screening at least once a year. At some point you're gonna have to go to a health provider. I feel like if you catch it early enough, we can you can fix it today. You know, I was at home one night and I just felt tightness in my chest. I was diagnosed with uh, congestive heart failure. It was uh, something that I, I can completely recover from as long as mm -hmm. I took proper care of myself. All men out there, just put your health first. So don't, don't ignore any signs. Like I had been having the shortness of breath symptoms for almost a week. Trust your instinct. Uh, you can also make sure you take good care of yourself and, and have our regular visits with your doctor because it literally will save your life. My first operation was with Dr. Roper, and that was prostate cancer. And going to my primary all the time and having the PSA taken, and they thought it would be good to check it out. I had the prostate removed, and it was the boundaries were great. And ever since, I'm, as I say, I'm alive because of Wellstar. I'm Murphy Townsend. I'm a urologist in the Wellstar Health System. We deal with a number of men's health issues in the urology office, including, of course, prostate cancer. Prostate cancer is one of the disease processes that affects one in six men. Men are not always the quickest to go to the doctor, so there's a lot of anxiety going into a doctor's visit. I can't tell you how many patients come to the urology office with high blood pressure. <laughs> and they don't normally have high blood pressure, but it's an anxious place to be. We recommend a once a year screening starting at 50. It gives me the opportunity not just to talk to them about urologic issues, but about general mental health issues. Overall, you know, we need guys to be more involved in their health care, and, and I think now more than ever, uh, men are, and um, it's, it's enjoyable to be able to participate in that case.